Welcome to Dismanagement in Windows Server 2008 Part 2. Let's look at how to create a basic primary partition. First we'll right click on the unallocated space and choose New Simple Volume. Go ahead and click Next. And we're going to put the size of the volume in as 250. Uh, we're going to tell it to assign a drive letter. And then we're going to format it with NTFS. Now the reason why I'm going through these three steps is because when we actually look at the command line interface we'll have to do each one of these separate so here's the command line interface we'll list the disk we'll select the disk we'll go ahead and create the partition and I'm going to go ahead and create a 250 meg partition So when it creates it it's going to create it raw so what we need to do now is verify that that partition is selected and it is and then we're going to have to go ahead and format it and you'll watch it being formatted and then we have to assign a drive letter so very similar to the GUI now let's look at how to extend and shrink a partition which is a new feature in 2008 all you have to do is right click on the partition and check extend volume and then go ahead and calculate how much you want to extend it by. So we'll extend this by 250 meg. And go ahead and click finish. And it's done. This is something that you actually needed partition magic for in the past. We can shrink the volume the same way. And I'm going to shrink it 100 meg. All right, let's try that via the command line. First, we'll list the volumes go ahead and select the volume that you want to work with and then we're going to type extend and how much we want to extend it by and in this case it's going to be 250 meg and you'll notice that the change reflected up top now let's shrink it again we're going to list the volumes we're going to go ahead and select the volume and once it's selected we're going to type shrink the desired amount we want to shrink it and it's now shrunk